What time is it, Mark? It's lunchtime, obviously. Ah. Got a question. This was kind of a question and a statement. I struggle from high lip bunkers, this uh, man said in one of the videos. So for me, high lip bunkers is about trying to get as much loft on the club through twist. So I've got my 60 degree and then I'm going to add loft by turning it around the axis of this shaft. So almost trying to lay the back of it on the sand. And then if my, con my impact point's all right, I'm going to go for a lot of speed. To really pop that one up in the air. Ooh, good shot. Now I am on a bit of an upslope here, so it's helping. And obviously you can get higher lips than this. So if I put myself back here on the flat, same ideas. I'm going to go as much twist as I can, subject to how high the lip is. So pretend the lip is here. I'm going to have no handle lean. If anything, I'm going to lean it back. I'm going to have a nice wide stance, ball up towards my lead foot, front foot. And I'm actually going to get really low with my handle and everything. I'm going to feel literally like I'm trying to go through the sand like this. Yeah. Is that similar to what you would do? Um, so I don't want really much of this. Yes. So by being low, to me, I feel like I can get kind of this way at it. Yeah. Almost shallower. Okay. Because I just want to have no downward action yeah. at all. Yeah. Because I'm on the flat now, so there's nothing helping me with up. I'm get low as much angle as I can. Again, contact point's going to stay pretty much the same, inch to inch and a half behind the ball for me. Again, loads of speed bounced it slightly but it still popped up so what I mean by bounced it we've been hitting a few bunkers shots in here so I've caught the bottom of the sand and the back of the club which you imagine is laying right onto the ground as I hit bounced and came out so I didn't get that kind of swiping underneath of the ball I bounced a little bit more closer into it so it came out with a bit more speed always going to be a danger when you play with massive angles if you start exaggerating angles so loft angle setup angles and also how much speed I'm applying oh, there you go there's a popper I didn't yeah. get enough distance because I didn't have enough speed but you get the angle so you're going to pop it it's going to struggle to go that way which is why you've got to keep that speed up but as soon as you start exaggerating all those angles you will have a few disasters so you only do this when you have to if you get in these situations and you've not practiced them kind of like what we're doing here yeah you won't know how risky you can be or not, and you probably might just pop it into the bank. It's about playing in this situation. The you say only, to that, Matt, the only what thing would you I add? would say, and I think would also help you, um, is entry point's really important still, and obviously you need that speed and loft. And when you're doing it, you're going this way. Yeah, yeah. And then your low point goes back, and yeah. then your strikes, like, a, yeah, it's too inconsistent. So. Yeah. Although, I've always struggled. I'm, I'm a natural leaner. Yeah. That's why my driver just is so comfortable because yeah, I want yeah. to lean and hit up at it. So I totally agree with you. Like there. the only thing that I would say is try and feel like you're still on this side even though it goes against yeah. going up. But this is where it becomes a little funky for people is where you basically go like this. Yes. <laughs> it's a contradiction. Yeah, it's not like this yeah, to I like try that. and help. I, I always go forward and back more and I feel real more extreme so then my low point is in the right spot and I've still got loads of loft on that club and try and get my entry point good every yeah, time. Yeah lovely popper there like that a lot yeah so, so just work careful on this. with your leans. Yes like I have full swung that and that's gone 10 yards. Really like that <laughs> really like that and I agree when I start exaggerating angles I get a little bit yeah, everywhere. Too much that way. So it, and that does feel so counterintuitive to yeah. be there with that there. Yeah. But I totally agree with you and then give it some speed. Good shot. And that's popping up, lovely. High one. Like it, Matt. Lunchtime, I'm hungry.